swept all their regular season home games, swept all their playoff games, and tonight they finish their sweep through the finals. The Seattle Storm are the undisputed champs of the WNBA. It was the crowning achievement to a historic, record-breaking season. The Storm is celebrating a championship, only the second one for the city of Seattle in 30 years. Kyra 7's Chris Francis watched it all unfold in Atlanta. He's live with reaction from the champs. Pretty sweet, Chris. Well, Angela, I have to tell you, at some point, I'll admit that I thought for sure we were going to be back here for a Game 4 on Sunday. But somehow, as they have done all year long, the storm found a way to reach their ultimate goal. For the second time in their 11-year history, they held the trophy high. Sue Bird, Lauren Jackson, and the rest of the Seattle Storm capping a perfect playoff run with a three-game sweep over Atlanta. There were tears, smiles, and hugs. Bird summed up the nearly perfect season best. You have no idea what it's like to go into a season, have a goal, work really hard, go through a lot of ups and downs, and to actually accomplish it. No better feeling than that. A loud contingent of fans from Seattle, family and friends, enjoyed it with them. But they were on the edge of their seats. Oh, some of us are physicians and nurses, and we were relying on them if we needed them. Thank God we didn't. Yes, another nail-biter. The dream led by 35 points from Angel McCautry had a five-point lead midway through the third quarter. But then Swin Cash got hot, really hot. Back-to-back three-pointers followed by a Sue Bird three and a Jackson layup. A 16 to one run that gave Seattle control. It's the same thing with us, resiliency. You know what I mean? Continue to plug, plug, plug away. Put ourselves in a great position to win the game and at the end steal it. I don't know, man, this is great. Our fans are the best. They came all the way from Seattle. Hey! <laughs> man, I don't know what to say. In the locker room afterwards, teammates had a special greeting for league MVP Jackson, who won the finals MVP tonight as well. Like, I did not expect, you know, like I said, to have this sort of season. But um, it's not, it was my teammates. Um, I wouldn't have achieved any of it without um, the great players that we have on our team. And, of course, those Storm fans were the last ones to leave the arena today. They camped out here at the arena to wave goodbye to the team bus, which went on to its team hotel, where the party no doubt continues even at 2 a.m. Live in Atlanta, Chris Francis, Cairo 7 Eyewitness News.